So this is just a quick video for uh, Reddit to show the idea of creating uh, two intersecting pipes. As you can see, I am in FreeCAD point two one point two. I'm running it uh, as an app image in uh, Linux Mint. So we are in part design. We will create a body and create a sketch. So you can see here, top is this plane. Front is this plane, and right is right and left of this plane. And I said in my original instructions to take a vertical plane. So we're going to take this one, say how it's vertical compared to a horizontal. We're going to take a vertical plane, and now this is the center. And what we want to do is create a circle with the center there, and we're going to dimension it, and we'll say its diameter is 20 millimeters. Okay, so there is our pipe, and we'll hit close, and then we'll use up here, this is pad, so we'll go for its loft, and we're going to do it, let's do 100. Alright, so there is our first pipe. Now, we'll go back to our model, and you can see there's our pad, right? We're going to stay in this body, and we're going to create a new sketch. As you can see, now we have our planes again. Now I want to create a horizontal one. So that would be, looking at the top, that would be this one. And now you can see that we have our dot here again. And again, we're going to center it on that center axis and bring it out. And we're going to set its diameter. This time we're going to go for 30. So we have, actually, let's make it even larger. Let's make it 40. Like so. Now it's fully constrained, we can close, and we're going to also pad that. But, now I said to use two dimension, because right now you'll see that this is going from the center up. We're going to go over here to dimension and say two dimensions. And now it's set to 10 millimeters each way. And what I'm going to do is actually change this to 12 and 12. So now you can see that it's, it is now set up so that it's above and below. We hit OK. Now, because we centered on the same, this pipe here is actually extended into here, but this is now one body. Okay? So now we can select this top face and create a new sketch on that, and we still have the same thing here. Grab another circle, center it, and we're going to set its diameter, and we'll make that one 30. Okay, that's fully constrained, and now we're going to go over here, and this is a pocket, right? We're going to create that pocket. Now, remember, we did 12 and 12, which is 24, so we'll set this to 24. I click off of it, and you'll see it goes all the way through. Okay, so now we have a ring, and you can see now that this is curved to fit around that. So the last thing we have to do now is make this a pipe, so we're going to select this end one, create a sketch and again we have our center dot so we'll grab the center and we'll make this one 10 fully constrained and we're going to pocket that one and we did this a hundred so we can do this a hundred and you can see it comes through that's the basis of what I was trying to tell you in words, but done visually. Hopefully that will help you.